and welcome back to my YouTube channel. This week we are doing a muffin top burner workout that's going to help you guys shed fat on the side of your stomach and it's also going to help to tone up the obliques. Don't forget to check out the link below because I'm also sharing with you guys a three day flat belly detox that's going to help you guys lose weight and it's the best thing that I advise anyone to do on the start of their health and fitness journey. Also don't forget to hit the like and subscribe button for my channel because I upload weekly workouts. Okay guys, so this whole routine is going to be done on the floor. We're going to be doing 30 seconds on it with a 10 second rest. I'm going to be showing you guys the routines that we're going to be doing throughout the entire thing, so don't worry. To begin, we're going to be lying on the floor on our backs and we're going to be doing cross crunches. So let's get going. Okay guys, so like I said, we are starting on the floor. So all I want you to do is come down onto your backs. Make sure that you lower yourself down nice and gently to protect your back. So we're doing 30 seconds in total. For this move, make sure that you do have your back flat on the floor. All I want you to do is drive one leg up and make sure that your elbow is touching the knee. So make sure to exhale every single time you are doing the crunch and do make sure that you're lifting your shoulder blade off of the floor. So just power through here guys, you've got 30 seconds. Excellent job, so you've got a 10 second rest before we move into the next exercise, which is wind wipers. So all I want you to do is have your arms out, almost like in a T position, exercise. flat on the floor, and you just want to move your legs together to the left and to the right. Now, if you guys can't go all the way down to the floor, that's not a problem, just do your very best and just go at your own limits. Make sure to suck that navel into the spine. balancing wood choppers so all I want you to do is bring your feet up into a 90 degree angle like a boat position and I just want you to bring your arms up and down like you are chopping wood now this is great because it's going to help niche in your waist and it's also going to help to burn off any fat that you have on the side so just make sure you bring your arms up down up and down make sure when you're bringing your arms down you are exhaling We've got a 10 second rest and we're going to repeat that on the other side next. So let's bring those legs up and go. Exercise. Remember keep that navel sucked into the spine. I want your stomach nice and contracted during the entire workout. So now we're going to pick up the intensity and we're going to go into side plank dips. So what I want you to do is come onto your elbow. Now if for any reason you need to modify this, you can do this on your knees. But if not, please come up into a full plank position like I am doing. And just bring your hips down and up, down and up. Now make sure every single time that you are driving your hip back up, you're exhaling out, you're sucking that navel into your spine and you're really thinking about the mind muscle connection. Remember, you just got 30 seconds on here. Rest. Excellent job, guys. So let's switch over and target the other side now. So again, repeating the same process. Come down onto your elbow, lift yourself up, Exercise. and then up, down. Remember, like I said, if you guys do need to go on your knees, you are welcome to do so. Make sure you're really driving that hip as high as you can. Excellent. Okay, so the next workout that we're going into is plank taps. So what I want you to 
to do is come down into a plank position and all you're going to do is step out to the side and then to the other side. So all you need to do is literally tap your feet either side of you. Make sure to suck that navel into your spine, you don't want your stomach handling over and make sure that you really are thinking about engaging the obliques every single time you're tapping out. Well done, let's go into the next exercise. So I want you back on the floor and we're gonna be doing oblique crunches. So what you wanna do is you wanna have your legs facing one way. Exercise. All you wanna do is drive yourself up into a crunch position and really think about engaging that side of your oblique muscles. Remember to exhale every single time you're coming into the crunch. Make sure you're lifting those shoulder blades off of the floor as well. Yes, excellent. Let's switch over now to the other side. Exercise. So we're repeating the same thing here on the other side now. So just make sure that you are really lifting those shoulder blades off of the floor and you are contracting your obliques. Great work guys, now we're just going to do the final exercise here in this routine and that is going to be hip dip planks. So I want you to come down onto your elbows in a plank position and exercise. literally just twist your hips to the left and to the right. Remember this is just for 30 seconds to so give it your all. Excellent. So just take a breather here guys, grab some water, stretch out if you need to. We are going to repeat this whole thing all over again because I do really want to help you guys tone up the side of your abs and I want to help you shed any fat that you are looking to shed. So just like I said, take a breather, take a stretch and then we'll get straight back into it in a second. So let's go back onto the floor, start with the first exercise, which is those cross crunches. Exercise. So bring that knee up towards the elbow, really bring your shoulder blades off of the floor and exhale every single time you are crunching. So the next exercise, guys, if you remember, is those wind wipers. So have your arms straight out onto the floor, bring your feet up into a 90 degree. Exercise. And then just slowly twist your hips to the left and to the right. Make sure this is nice and controlled, guys. Like I said, go as low down as you can. we're going into is those balancing wood choppers so again pick the side that you want to begin with first let's bring those knees up and bring the arms up and down up and down remember to make sure you're breathing through the entire exercise exhale every single time the arms are coming down the other side. 
So bring those legs up and up, down, up, down. drive those hips down and up. Remember you guys can modify if you want. which is going to be those plank taps. So remember, I want you to come into a full plank position for this one. All we're going to do is step our feet out, in, out, in. Make sure that your bum is not too high and not too low. You just want to be in a nice straight line. the floor lying on our backs remember this is oblique crunches so we want to come to one side pick whatever side you'd like to begin with and all you need to do is just drive yourself forward in a crunch like position bring your shoulder base off the floor and think about really engaging that opening area over to the other side so the exact same thing here guys just move your legs and then make sure to drive yourself up in that front flat position guys now you're going into the final exercise of this whole routine and that is those hip dip planks so what I want you to do is come down into your elbows in a plank position and just twist those hips for me as it guys keep going you've just got 30 seconds left of this entire workout and then you guys are done done you've done so well in completing this routine with me if you guys would like to see further results i highly recommend that you do also check out a hip workout of mine to help get the heart rate up and burn extra calories so that's the end of your muffin top workout guys i hope you really did enjoy this one today with me don't forget to give me a like and subscribe to my channel and also don't forget to leave me a comment below on what you thought of this workout and what you guys would like to see next also, don't forget to get your three-day flat belly detox from me that's going to help you guys lose weight along with this workout. 
Have a lovely morning, afternoon, evening, whatever time it is for you, and I'll see you guys very soon. Oh,